Good morning. Vlogmas day number 10. Countdown number 15. Shut up, Mosey. It hurts. I'll look at it more now that we're in the light in a minute. Ben's heel says, he says it hurts. What do we got, Emma? Oh, we got those and the paper. Let me see it, or Ben? Oh, mm. me. All right, here. Sound it out. Pin. Pick. Pick. Nick. Picnic. Picnic by the tree. The Christmas tree. So dinner tonight will be a picnic by the tree. Right? We're sitting here having breakfast. Ben's having a chocolate chip waffle today. On this Thursday morning. Emma's having my new breakfast burrito roll-ups. They have the what? Bacon, egg and cheese. And I'm having honey checks. That was called? No. Honey nut checks. Yum yum. Okay, so I just left the market. It's 10 past 11. I had a late start today because I ended up talking with um, one of Benjamin's friend's moms. Um, she usually walks. She shares a car with her mom. So when it's certain days if she has to walk and it's cold, whatever, she needs a ride. And I don't mind. She's just down the street. So I ended up talking with her from 9 to 9.45. Um, so I had a late start. Now I'm home. Um, went to the market. Went, well, first went to the bank, went to the market. And now I have the fun of emptying everything into the house and into the fridge. And then I'm going to have lunch. And then I'm going to look. I think I'm going to go and either finish up stocking stuffers or um, presents for their, their teachers. Um, get a go on that. So that'll be going to Dollar Tree. And I totally forgot when I went by my mom's this morning for the bank. I forgot to drop off the stuff I had for her. Because of my talking with the friend, I totally forgot. So that's where I am. It's gorgeous out. It's right now it says it's 59. It was supposed to be about 60 today, which is crazy. It's in the middle of December. It's supposed to be freezing cold. I don't know what's going on this year. Talk to you later. Hey, so it is 12.30. I brought all the food in, put it away. Had my lunch, talked to my husband for too long. Um, we had some things to discuss with Christmas. Um, we talked for about, I don't know, at least a half an hour. And um, what else? I watched a video on YouTube, one of my favorite people. And um, it is gorgeous out, I got the back window. And now I have, oh, that was a bad shot. I have to put the dishes in the dishwasher because I cleaned out my um, fridge and there's containers that are yucky and the dishes from last night. So yeah, I'm um, a little behind on dishes because I've been busy. So I end up doing them around this time each day. Um, I just got a phone call, and I'm sorry, my hair is a, a mess today. <clears throat> I got the call, Benjamin's glasses are here, I cannot believe it, it's only Thursday, and we went Monday, and they said, oh, about two weeks, <laughs> and she's like, I guess that's what they have to say in case there's problems, I'm hoping that they're going to be good when we get there, so what I'm going to do is... Pick up the kids, then pick up Sebastian, and then head to the mall and get those. So I think I'm going to hold off on going to Dollar Tree. I was going to go there and spend some money for um, some stuff I have to get and for their teacher gifts. But I think I'll wait and do that tomorrow. 
I think once I bring the kids to school tomorrow, I'll go do that and stop at Stop and Shop. They're right next to each other and get the last few ingredients that they didn't have. And I kind of forgot one of them that they had there already. But anyway, so I got two more hours and I need to go over me and my husband's Christmas list. He wants me to get an idea of how much everything would cost if he were to get everything on my list and see if that's around a budget for us. Usually we do 200 a piece, so if it's more than that, you know, I'll check off which ones I really, really want, and we'll figure out his list. And, um, because there's a couple of here that, well, like, one that's kind of expensive that would be half his budget. So he could wait and do that for his birthday in March. So i got to go over those things. So I think I'm going to do that now. Um, go sit on the couch so it doesn't hurt my tushy. I think I've been sitting on these chairs too much lately at the computer. Um, my little butt and hip area is feeling better today, which is good, so I don't want to make it get worse again. And after that, that's about it for now. Talk to you later. Hey everyone, so it is just about 2 o'clock. My lens isn't staying open. But, um, I just had a really brilliant idea. I've been thinking about it because I saw a few of you do this out here on YouTube which was to just do a walk through my planner. Um, I'm really excited about it. Um, I feel as though it's my first Erin Condren, my first really big one, because before this I used to do just the Mead from like Walmart, the little one. I can also show you that one, how I had progressed. Um, maybe either in tomorrow's vlog or one day next week, kind of in this intermittent of being bored, kind of a day if I have one next week because it's going to get busier and busier as the days go by <laughs> leading up to Christmas. But I want to show you. So I started this in July. It was a birthday present in June from my parents and I started for the first week of July. Let me show you what I have. So this is my cover. I had it personalized with my name on it. And this is the gray with the pool color. And I love it. And this is an 18-month planner, so it is getting kind of chunky. Um, so that's why this is the only time I'll have an 18-month, because I wanted to start with it for my birthday when I finally realized I want my Erin Condren. So I got an 18-month, so next Christmas I'm going to just get a 12-month, and every year that'll be a Christmas present that I get, probably from like my husband or my parents if they want to do it. Um, so let's get into it. So that's the inside. I love it. Sorry if there's a glare because I do have the light on above me. Um, I put this when I went to the um, Children's Museum with the children and my mom this past summer. They had a little um, petting zoo and you got to hold a little piglet and you could kiss one and they give you a sticker. So I kissed a pig and I liked it. So I put that there. So now, as of these, I figured I would wait and do it starting in next year, in 2016. I have written the months in, and I'll just put um, goals and things that I want to get done. Up here is my dates of when my bills are due. I just taped it with a little piece of washi tape. Alright, so my first month, I, I didn't do this first. I went and did my week first. And then throughout July, I came to realize what I wanted to do with the monthly spread. And just basically, it's just to mark down birthdays, special events, or things that happen. We had our roof replaced, um, the orthodontist for Benjamin, when we went to the lake, when we went to the beach, Sebastian had his camp out. We have a um, local feast at one of the um, you know parishes near us. Okay, so here's my first week. The week of the 29th through July 5th. And you'll see it's pretty much consistent. I do washi tape down below. I do my meal planning down here. This is a, um, a sticker I got off Etsy that my mom bought for me for my birthday. And I didn't really care for it because I really didn't need to track breakfast and lunch. Just my dinners. I used some scrapbooking paper. Um, post-it notes, and then just stickers that I do have from being a heavy scrapbooker in the past, and I kept them. 
I'm trying to see if that's yeah there we go the lens was dirty and then I've printed my own stickers um, these are my printables that I've printed myself off of um, a blogger the weather ones so those I just make for f not free but you know you get your sticker paper and then you just print them up I went on to my second week because I have a bunch this is just a summer theme and I just try to use whatever washi I have to indicate the weekend. I don't usually have weekend banners, but I did have a freebie here that I just ended up putting on top so that I wouldn't ruin. I was trying to track my water. Those I just printed out myself. And there's that one. Then I did a pink and purple butterfly theme. I love butterflies. My daughter loves Ariel, and so don't I, so I did a Ariel themed. I had a sticker book that I got at, I'm not even remembering if it was Dollar Tree or one of the Michaels. For only a dollar I had gotten the sticker book. And I love this one. This is one of my favorites. I use this page when I need to, so like being that August was coming of what I needed to do, which was get the children's supplies for school, so I made a little list and checked it off as I got them. So August was our month of our summer vacation. We went um, road trip, we went to Cape Cod for the weekend, came back Monday, and then we did day trips throughout the next week. And it was also my mom's birthday on the 10th. And just getting ready for school. So this is our week where we left here and went on vacation. This here was a Lisa Frank themed. Again, I had one of those books. This was from Dollar Tree, the Lisa Frank. Then it's our vacation week and I did a Minions theme. And up on the top was the different things that we did and then a to-do list, and then my YouTube. And each day I vlogged, so if you haven't seen it, you can go back in August, August 1st to the 9th, and I have vlogs for my whole vacation. Then it was a birthday theme for my mom's birthday on the 10th. Then I did a Winnie the Pooh Bear themed. And I try to pick stuff that goes with the colors in the months, being that I can't afford to get any cover-ups for the labels. I write it in myself, so the color is going to stay. Um, I'm hoping to get for Christmas some thin washi, and maybe that will cover them, if I do decide to do something that doesn't match the color. So here's when I started um, using the Erin Condred labels that come with the book, the planner, as my menu. And I like this theme a lot. This week here was really pretty. I like Pooh as well. My brother loved him growing up. My children love him. My mom does. Even my husband. Um, Classic Pooh was my son's nursery. So. Then for summer I did a watermelon theme. I had some that were from scrapbooking. Some I printed up myself. And some were just in the uh, sticker books that I had. This is another cute one. Here I just did some September goals that I wanted to achieve. And back to school. This is May. A back to school month. And just some interesting things that happened. The Boy Scouts camping. Ben starts his CCD. When I got I was excited and I found the lip gloss at Dollar Tree. And on the sides of them, I do use my Dollar Tree dots, and I write my goals down here. Okay, back to school week. These were great. I had these in my scrapbooking supplies. They were like a strip. Really, really cute. Down here. Then this is just a pink and purple owl theme that I had a book of from either Michaels or AC Moore. The Groovy Owls Darcy book. And I love pink and purple. And I had the pink owl washi tape so I used that to signify the weekend. This is the one I don't like. 
Um, and I kept saying, no, I shouldn't do it. And I went for it. And they're all like small My Little Pony stickers that I had. And so it's not very like stand out, pow in your face, My Little Pony. And so the colors, it's, it's just not that pretty, I don't think. I love these. These are pretty and stuff. But overall, it just doesn't look that great. Maybe too, it's because they have a lot of white space. I gotta check my phone. It's my husband. <laughs> Okay. All right. Next week was, um, we decided to, the kids wanted to camp out and we didn't really want to go out into a campground because we're just busy this weekend and really all this month. So we said, let's do camping in our backyard. Um, so that's what we did. We did it Friday night into Saturday, me and my husband with the two little ones and then Sebastian was here so he slept out there with them and we got to stay in the house Saturday night so it's a camping theme and I like this one I really do it's cute so here I didn't really have anything I had started my own budget planner um, if you haven't seen I don't know if I introduced that in any of my old videos comment below if you want to see it and I can also show you my Christmas planner one of these days in my vlog so then it's October month we have a bunch going on it's not only Halloween I have my son turned seven over here my stepson turned 13 my sister-in-law is here 34 we had cheer competition um, you know, you got to go pumpkin picking, getting ready for Halloween, buying the costumes, and all that good stuff. This is when my son had his croup and was in the hospital that morning. And again, just the goals on the side. So then I did a donut theme with those awesome Dollar Tree donut stickers and some others that I printed up myself. This one here, it... These colors don't match it quite as well, the donut colors, but it's okay because it's just a multicolored donut. Then for his birthday week, his birthday is on the Sunday, and that's when we had his party, which was superheroes. So I, I indicated his birthday here, and then overall we did a Avengers um, sticker theme. I also got that from, I believe, Dollar Tree. A booklet of a whole bunch for a dollar. And the day before we went pumpkin picking. Then we did, I did, I should say, a pumpkin theme. <laughs> These are just um, scrapbooking paper. This one here as well. All these full boxes are just scrapbooking paper over here as well. And I use pumpkins from all the different Darcy books that I've gotten. All different ones. Then it was leaves. And I was able to go and get the leave washi from Target for three bucks. I like this one a lot. And the pumpkin one. I love the fall colors. So here's when Sebastian had his sleepover. And again, November, figuring out Thanksgiving outfits. And again, I just leave some sort of things to get ready for Halloween. I do a special dinner on Halloween night. And just some other post-it notes that I needed. So here's my Thanksgiving month. If you can see, it's giving a glare. It says, thanks. Again, from a Darcy book. <laughs> we went to tag our tree at the farm, and then we get it cut, and we bring it home. And my goals for the month. So Halloween week. This is Halloween. This is cute as well. So this I didn't have any more orange labels from Erin Condren. So I just used a post-it note that I did have an orange. Really cute. I loved this little girl. 
Then I did my Wizard of Oz because I my mom had given me a book she forgot to give me for my birthday. A Wizard of Oz Darcy book. And then I also had some in the scrapbooking stickers that I had. This here, the um, poppy ones, that was with a Wizard of Oz sheet. Just a, like one sheet. And it has those magic slippers will take you home. And that's like a little strip. And so I used it here to indicate my weekend. Here is my lips themed. I think that's wicked cute. And we went to the movie and I just put that in with the little clip that you get with the Erin Condred to save. And I want to do, um, and I have some Project Life cards that I'm going to do for this week. Being that my son found out Monday he got his glasses, that he have to get glasses. And today they came in. So I want to be going to pick up the kids and then we're headed to the store to pick up his glasses. Here is just a purple and teal theme. I just went with colors, so I just grabbed any kind of stickers that I had. I didn't use that many. Just some cute ones, flowers, butterflies, hearts, whatever I had. Then it was Thanksgiving week. And again, I had the other sheet that says thanks. And this is a big bulky one, so that's going <laughs> to... Be tough to write, you know, with the other pages, but I'm dealing with it. I love this little girl. So again, these are just page flags. And I went and I bought this gold one to kind of go with these two washies that I used. It was a little bit thinner, so I used that. Here are just some ideas for my vlog of the turkey uh, snacks that we did. This is for a list for Christmas. <laughs> I found it. <laughs> Last night, I couldn't find my husband's Christmas list. And I said, well, let me look today. And then he's like, when we were talking earlier, <clears throat> he said, <clears throat> look for that list. I think you lost it. I'm like, maybe I did. I didn't. I kind of went through my planner, too, yesterday night, and I didn't see it. It's sitting right here. I'll wait until I tell him. So now I can see if there was anything else that he had asked for. I don't think so. No, he did good. Okay. So here's December. And what I did was I wrote down in red or green the different things on the countdown and added stickers to go along with that special event that we're doing. Like here it's the candy cane chase, which is going to be tomorrow. Tonight, it's the picnic by the tree, dinner time, and that's what I did. Um, his Christmas with Santa, no school, I used the washi tape to indicate that, my dad's birthday. I'm going to take this off. First week of December, Christmas theme for the month of December, except for the last week, I'm going to do New Year's. So if you haven't seen my Plan With Me's, these are my page flags from Target. I got three of them in the first round that I went, and I just grabbed another one. Because when I started doing this, and I was like, oh my god, I know I'm going to have planners for a long, long time, and I love this for Christmas. Um, so I figured I am going to use them. And I did put some in some of my um, pocket letters. So I am spreading the love with the ones that I bought. And I love the um, Dollar Tree washies. And this here is the ones that I've been getting at Michael's. A whole strip of really pretty, um, I don't even know what you call it, but sticky kind of like ribbon in all different designs. I'll show you. For $1, no, $1.50. So here's this week, my second week for Christmas. And so see here I have a zigzag. It's a little bit thick, but not too bad. And then like this one here. That comes in it with an all green. You get like maybe six of them. And then you can get one all red, all silver, all white, and all pink. Really pretty. And I did order the countdown to Christmas up there off of Etsy. I made my paper clips myself with the felt pieces. Put the two together. Glued them on a paper clip from Dollar Tree. And here's what I just did yesterday. Because again, I'm not filming this one. You should have seen 
this one in my last plan with me. So next week, the 14th through the 20th. And I haven't filled out my to-do list much. But it will. Towards this weekend, I'll start filling it in. Really cute. And that is it for now. So thank you so much for watching this. And if you don't enjoy these, don't feel bad if you skip through. Um, it is now quarter past two. I gotta get ready to pick up the kids and go get the glasses. Um, we will definitely be vlogging when we pick up the glasses. So that way my husband and my mother and Aunt Norny, whoever wants to see the actual live when he gets his glasses, um, we will have it documented. I felt awful on Monday. I, I got in home or we were driving out, we were out together, and I said, oh my God, I should have taken a picture of him trying on or taking a video. Because I think I took the camera too, and then I just totally, totally forgot and just lived the moment. So you know what? That's what mommies get to do. You know, I've been able to be a stay-at-home mom for a little while. i got to find a job now soon. And um, I've enjoyed the moment, and it was special. He is my, my sweetheart, my little boy, growing up too fast. So we will see you again later. Hey, guys. It's about quarter past three. I got the kids. Say hi. I believe I could fly. <laughs> We're going to get Sebastian, and then we're heading to pick up Ben's glasses at the mall. It's about a 15, 20, probably like a 20 minute ride. I believe I can fly. See you after. Okay, so it's now 3.30, we got Sebastian. He's feeling better. Say hey. Hi. Hi. He's back. We're having sandwiches with fresh pineapple and cheese curls. That's dinner. Make, and that worked out perfect that it's quick and easy since we have to go and get this, the glasses. I'm probably not going to get home till 4.30, quarter of 5. So, they'll have to finish up their homework and eat dinner. And Ben and Emma got presents today. Guys, who did you get presents for? Did you get everybody? Mama, I got, I got everybody. Mama, Mama Ben, Dada. And, and Sebastian? Ben. And Sebastian? All right, awesome. Okay. All right. So we will see you at the, how do, what do you call it? An eye doctor. There's a term for it. An, uh, uh, there's, it's right there on the store, too. I saw it last, on Monday. Oh, I know. I, I, I forget. The, 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 Dermatologist. Yeah. I can't think of the name of it. Uh, Dermatologist is the face thing. Um, I want to say something E, but I don't know if that's right. Something. We will see you there in 20 minutes or so. Ooh, how do you how do you see in them? Does do you look good? Does things look better when you put them on? Yeah. Well, you look so handsome. <laughs> so Daddy can see, huh? Here we are. It looks like is this his case? Yes. Oh, nice. No, put them back on. She wants to check them out. Yep. Yeah, they're, they're loose. You can shake your head. Let me shake your head. Yeah. I'm just in for you. They look cute. Okay. <laughs> Is this the case? Yep. What do you think? We'll use that one and then maybe we'll tell Santa to get you a new one if you want. This is really cute. You like that one? Yeah. Okay. So when you're at school, right, you put them in your case when you go to like uh, lunch and stuff. All right, she's gonna fix them for you. Make sure they're nice and tight. This still bothers me. Like, I need to think of the eye doctor name. Oh, that name, I bet you they'll know. All right, what's the name of the ologist for eye? Optometrist. Optometrist, that's yeah. it. We were trying to figure it out in the yeah. car. <laughs> and the surgeon is an ophthalmologist. Oh, they're close, yeah. yeah. <laughs> cool. And morning. It's not morning. And said it. Because I'm sleeping. Oh, Ben, I just had the blanket out. We're having dinner by the tree. But Ben just screwed up my thing. The blanket. I don't play with that. Oh.
Making some yummy grinders. We got fresh pineapples, pickles, and cheese curls. And then Daddy and Sebastian have scouts. Twenty-third. What does? Vacation. Christmas vacation. Yeah, they're off as of the twenty-second day last day. Mm -hmm. No, just sit still and eat I'm, your dinner. I'm gonna be kind of disappointed if it's the twenty-third because they got Ben and They have the twenty-second ah. and then the twenty-third is their vacation. Hi. It's because of these Christmas lights on the tree. We have to turn it off. All right. So sorry for the the non-focus. It's hard because we have twinkling lights on the tree. And it doesn't focus over here. But we're having our picnic dinner. Let's see, might go better. Yep, it's focusing better over here. Not fully yet. There we go. And here's my dinner. Daddy! I've ate half my sandwich. Yummy! We had a pretty awesome day. I was so excited Ben got his glasses. It only took him three days. Not even, yeah, like three days. So it's about ten past seven. We're going to end the vlog here. Ben, show your face. How cute. Here's Ben with his glasses. He's doing so good. He read really good tonight. I think the glasses are helping him a lot. They're hanging out in the parlor. After this show, they're going to bed. Mommy's going to go edit the vlog. See you tomorrow.